Over the hill. Many years ago, Glyn, the coffee pot engine, used to look after Thomas's branch line. But even before Thomas came along, the, even before Thomas came along, the old engine had been moved from siding to siding and forgotten about. Until one day, just before Christmas. Tis the season to be jolly. Hey, be careful. You nearly hit me. <laughs> Glenn was rediscovered. And the Earl of Sodor arranged for Glenn to be restored. Brought him to work with Stephen up at Ulfstead Castle. Come on, Stephen. <laughs> it's a lovely morning. Ooh. Is it? Morning. Ooh. Is it? Oh, already? <laughs> oh, you're up early, Glenn. Why don't I give you a proper guided tour while the castle's close to the public? Hey, wait for me! Certainly is a pleasure to have you here at the castle, Glyn. You really are a marvellous engine. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Everyone keeps saying, Lily. Oh. Yeah, but of course, that was all I started expanding by a state. And what an estate it is, eh, sir? I always tell my uh, I always tell my visitors. Of course, I'm not finished expanding yet, and you, Glyn, are a major part of my plans for the future. Before Glyn had arrived, Stephen had felt like the king of the castle. But now he felt like he had lost his crown. Up next, the Dino Park. Have you ever seen a dinosaur, Glyn? I can't say I have. <laughs> I'm not as old as you, Stephen. Uh, I mean, uh, uh, you have got more experience than me. <laughs> I was one of the first engines ever built. And most of those built after me used my design. While you, teapots, quickly went out of use. I think you'll find Lynn and the other coffee pots had very long and productive working lives, Stephen. Remember the day I found King Godred's long-lost crown down there? <laughs> and I remember how you got trapped and had to be rescued, Stephen. Oh, Stephen. Oh, yes. Stephen was starting to wonder whether the Earl liked Glyn better than him. Thank you, Glyn. Enjoy the rest of the holiday. I've got something special planned when we reopen in the new year. Huh? I wonder what he means, Millie. I think the Earl is finally opening a railway museum. Great idea. I'll do the tours. You can do the teas and coffees, Glyn. Perhaps it will be Glyn doing the tour, Stephen, while you become an exhibit in the museum. You are the world-famous rocket after all. <laughs> I suppose even an old teapot like you knows how I got that name, Glyn. I beat four other engines at the Rain Hill Trial Trials. I know. It's no wonder you're such a celebrity, Stephen. The Rain Hill Trials are legendary. What? Okay. Oh, of course I'm okay. I want a nap for the winds and works at the castle. The loser becomes an exhibit in the Earl's Railway Museum. No, I, I don't think the Earl or Sir Topham Hatt will like that. <laughs> I need to find the Earl. 
the tracks in my day. <laughs> Yours too, I'm sure. Anyway, I'm not a great fan of rushing about. <laughs> you just wish you were... They made it onto the mainland and went onto two separate tracks. But they were still travelling at exactly the same slow speed. Of course, people take railways for granted these days. Mm, they, mm, they don't realise how much rail travel has opened up the world. Opened up the world. Express coming through! Oh, come on, old timers. Some of us have got work to do. Stephen! Get out of my way! Show some respect for your elders! Sorry! Respect for your elders! Sorry, Gordon! We're racing! <laughs> you call that racing? A sketch on a drawing board, young Gordon! <laughs> oh, good one, Stephen! <laughs> Would you like a glass of milk with that, young Gordon? <laughs> Before long... Everyone had heard about Stephen and Glynn's race and wanted to see it for themselves. Hello, hello! Make way for the rocket! This is my friend Glynn. He's a coffee pot engine. Hello! <laughs> thank you! Oh, 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 thank you! Well, you two have certainly caused more confusion and delay than I've seen for many years. And I don't usually approve of racing, especially on the main line. Oh dear, I'm sorry, sir. This is all my fault. No, no, it's mine, Glenn. Explained everything, but I'm glad to see you two have finally made friends. Did anyone actually win the race? No, sir. We came in together. Oh, that's marvellous. Especially since you'll be working together at the castle. Together? But I thought... I am going to open a railway museum, Stephen. And my star attraction will be both of you. Oh, oh that's fantastic. How marvellous. I agree with Sir Topham about not racing on the main line. But if we were to hold a race elsewhere, perhaps we could have a classic engine race every year. Oh, <laughs> 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 <laughs>